Street Advent Craft will be making gift boxes. Um, you can make them any size uh, from a square sheet of paper or cardstock. This one is an easy craft, uh, but a lot easier without my children helping me. So it's just me today, I'm afraid. So what you need is um, two sheets of square pieces of paper. On one of them, you'll be cutting about a centimeter off two sides, two consecutive sides, to make it just slightly smaller, because that'll be the lower box that will fit inside the the, um, the lid. So that one needs to be just, just that little bit smaller. First of all, what you need to do is you find the middle. So you want to um, either use a, a ruler to mark the middle, um, I kind of just use a sharp corner of a, of a counter and just like press it down to find a little crisscross in the middle. And um, once you've found the middle, um, meet all the corners into the into the middle so you make a, a smaller box. Um, you can open it back up again, maybe just keep one down. And now what you're going to do is you're going to fold up this corner to meet. And you open it up and then do the same on each of the other corners. So I'll now fold this one up to meet the middle. So I've done it with the last one now, open it up, and then what you'll have is this place with all the creases. So what you're going to do is on opposite sides, you're going to want to get your scissors out and cut. Uh, so if you can locate the middle box, that's going to be the either the top or the, the bottom of the box, so you don't want to cut into that, but cut along here and here to meet to that corner, and then again across here to here. Here to here. So I've done that now, and what I'm going to do in the sides that I did not cut, I'm going to fold that in. You can just kind of make those creases a bit stronger, and then we're going to fold these lines that are neat there, and these lines. So it looks like this, and all you do now is you just fold these sides over and in. There is a way to do this without having to use scissors, which is probably the proper origami way to do it. Um, but with card, I thought it was a little bit easier to cut it. With paper, you could fold it in like you would be folding a gift, but this way, you just have this nice little gift. You might want to stick this, these little corners down with some um, glue or um, or they might be fine without it, but um, sometimes they just kind of move around a bit. There you go. So that is my, that might be my lid. <laughs> I don't remember. Um, so that's, that's one of them. Um, and then I repeat it with the other one. And then whichever one ends up being the smaller one, obviously, is the bottom. So here we go. So there you have it, there's our box, uh, gift box, um, make them different sizes for what you need. Uh, next week our craft, our last advent craft, uh, is going to be story cubes that you can get your kids involved in with making colouring um, and then each side of the block tells a part of the Christmas story so maybe it would be a great way to um, get them involved with that as well. This one's a bit more of a grown up one but fun to do. If you have enjoyed making this craft and you are happy to upload a photo to our Facebook page, please do. Um, I would just love to know that I'm not the only one doing this. Um, but I hope that you've had fun doing this and um, see you next week. Bye.